Hello, my name is Cameron Marietta. I live in South Edward, New Jersey. And we've been having this really, really unseasonably warm weather lately. I'd say the past week or so, it's been up and down, but when it's up, it's really up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like in like the 60s and 70s. So what I did was I said, you know what? Since we're doing, since, since we're having a winter thaw, sort of, you know, it's like late February. It's like late February. Um, I decided that I would take some branches in and I would force them to bloom a little bit earlier than they would normally bloom outside. So I took here, this is a large branch, as you can see. This is a pussy willow. Okay, and these normally bloom um, in mid to late March, I believe. I read that online. I'm not too sure if that's true. But that's when they normally bloom. Um, then here I have one little one. I don't know if this is going to bloom. It's really small. It's a really small branch. I have a plum tree branch here that's really starting to bud, you know, and it's really starting to show its color, you know, the buds. And then we have a, um, a red maple. The red maple is really starting to bloom. Actually, the buds, if you look closer, and I'll show you that in the next video, if you look closer, they're really starting to open up. And little bristles are starting to shrivel their way out of the buds. And then as I come over here, I have cherry blossoms. These are all cherry blossoms. And these are going to take about a week or two or even three weeks to bloom. But they are starting to show that green tint, that green color in the bud, which is giving me the impression that they are starting to come out of dormancy. Um, and yeah, that's it. And I will keep you updated in the next video.